I want all of the officers and officials from law enforcement to know is as you run this course, you are running through the communities uh, with the athletes and families that we serve on a daily basis. A lot of people don't know uh, that we have four full sports seasons year-round that we're in operations in all of those cities and towns. Uh, we have 26 sports that we offer on a year-round basis. And we have 100 teams in southeastern Mass alone. I want to thank everybody for coming out. The, the level of participation as this event has continued over the last few years has grown. And it's really a great tribute uh, to law enforcement throughout Plymouth County. You know, everyone uh, involved in law enforcement really is, is uh, worthy of our thanks and our praise. The athletes look up to you, and uh, the general public looks up to you. So when you step out and do something like this, it, it really shows that you are deserving of that respect and the gratitude that we give. But most importantly, I, I just speaking for myself, I am so grateful that you do this, and I, I'm looking up to you with them today. So I appreciate you doing it. Be safe, have fun, and uh, live by the example that you set. Thank you very much. My name is Amanda Church, and I am a Special Olympics athlete and Global Messenger. From all the Special Olympics athletes in Massachusetts, thank you for running the torch run. Good luck. Great job, Amanda. We start over here. We have the motorcycles first, then the runners, then our chase van, and then the expedition following to bring people to their cars. The miles are marked on the side of the road. You'll see the Special Olympics symbol. You'll see the torch run symbol. Two torches that we're going to... As one draws down on the fuel, we'll replace it with a second. So it's not a magic torch that stays lit forever. Okay, it's go time. I think we can, uh, all runners, please proceed to the start line. Good luck, everybody. We'll see you in Brockton.